Hey guys, this is all stream that welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another episode of PGA 2K23. And uh, we are currently in first place in the FedEx Cup standings with 1087 points. Our sponsors are in um, perfect relationship. We have Adidas for the apparel, we have Callaway for the clubs and our balls. Our rival for this um, event is going to be Justin Rose. And we're going to be playing the Champions Invitational at Echo Park Golf Club. Now, I've won the last two, and I have uh, moved the settings, um, the difficulty for the players from... Um, let me see where it was. I've moved it from hard to very hard. Uh, conditions difficulty we're going to keep normal. If we win this one, then we're going to up the conditions difficulty as well. So let's go ahead and get into the Champions Invitational at Echo Park Golf Club. Okay, here is the first hole. It's a par four. 481 yards. A little bit fast, uh, as we always are. That's fine. Not many people have been able to claim that. Yeah, I don't think it's going to be all rosy at the end of today. This is definitely a tall order. And there we go. Justin has we should be on the green, and on the PGA Tour. we're going to roll off the green onto the fringe. Play, I'm going to say if he hits the fairway, when he hits the fairway, his iron play is just phenomenal. He's going to get it inside 20 feet every time, and then you know he's going to okay. cut. So, uh, yeah, good luck with that one. Well, he's the perfect Not too bad. He's an English gent with a killer glint in his eye. Good luck in this rivalry. Oh, I hope he makes this one. It's for par. And we should have that. Perfect. Well, that's a no fuss par to get the round underway, Rich. Very nice par indeed. Very solid hole played. Time to tee off. And we have a par five. Looks like they put a good swing on that one. That should find the short stuff. And yeah, it looks like we're going to um looks like we're gonna take three shots to get onto the green, and that is perfectly fine. Yeah, That's okay. Getting ready to play their third. That was not good. And technically, we're not on the green. Okay, now we're going to putt for par. Pretty good chance here. This one's for par. Let's see where it is to begin with. So to begin with, it's a little bit to the left. We're going to... Aim a little bit to the right. This one's and we've got it. We'll hold. Okay. Over to Justin Rose. It's been neck and neck. He's actually tied with his rival. This is tough. Can he do it? And Justin Rose with a... Oh, stop it. Very, very Where's good shot. Pass? Tough bunker shot. No bother whatsoever for this player. They find the bottom of the cup. We have a par four on this one. A little bit fast. We avoid all the danger. Well struck. Rich, when we talk about the English group of golfers over the last 20 years, really Justin Rose has been the... The star of them has okay. been major champion. It's not terrible. One, Hall of Famer. He's done it all. He certainly is that. And I have to say, he's probably one of the most resilient players. Okay, a little ever. bit more Since to the right. Pulling out that shot at the major championship years ago. And that should do it. And went out and missed 20 some odd cuts in a row. And never little too up. much. Kept after it, kept after it, which that would have broken. 
That would have broken most men, not Rose. That's why he's gone out and become a major champion. He is such a force in the game. There's no reason why he cannot play at a high level for many, Ooh. many years to come. The ball striking is phenomenal. I love his stroke. I love the way that, that he puts it. That puts us at I one over. So many good putts that just don't go in. It just kind of gets under his skin. Listen, don't let it, Rosie. You putt it fantastically. Keep after it. I love this man's game. He's such a talent. Great we do not want to miss a cut, so we need to start. You know, we need to play at the way three. that we know how. Choosing the nine iron here. Okay. Time to take a look at Justin Rose. Oh, he's out in front here in this rivalry, but can he stay that way? Hmm. Well, how about the concentration to pull that shot off? Okay, time to return to the action. And here we are with the third shot. Oh, that's all class. I'll take it. That'll help make a big move. Oh, I'd like to have one more look at that shot. I'm glad we get to see this again. This one should be practiced. That was a very good shot. Tommy Fleetwood is a top leaderboard with a one stroke. And yeah, we are one shot behind Justin Rose. This hole is a par three. Is it one you should attack or play the smart shot? Good birdie on the last. What's in store now? Good shot there. Birdie at the last. This for another. And we should have it. Looking really good. Okay. One. Wonderful shot. And with it, he moves to one under par. Solid play finds that play. And yep, that ties us with Justin Rose. Next up is this two shot hole. Really hoping they play this one aggressively. Okay, that works. Oh, that was pure. Second shot here on the sixth. Did not do what I thought it was going to. Well, that's a handy shot. What's in front of them, Henny, with this part? Yeah, nice little 25 footer here from him. Outside chance, so it'll be good to hold. If they sink this part, they'll pull ahead of Justin Rose. Let's see if they can ramp up this rivalry. And that did not quite work out. Oh, that's frustrating. And this putt coming up. Okay, we got the par. And now over to Justin Rose. He's trying to pull ahead in this group rivalry. Let's see what happens. What a shot! Almost okay. The bucket. And after that effort, let's take a look at how it stands. Billy Horschel currently in the lead here. And yeah, we're still tied with him. Seeing off here at the seventh. We have a par five for the seventh. This one's looking good off the tee. That should find the short stuff. There we go. Lovely effort that. Getting ready to play their third. Five shots off the pace. That was wonderfully done. Eight feet to the cup. And a 
little bit more. That'll work. And with that lovely play, they're now ahead of their rival. We overhit that one, but it still works. Take a look at Justin Rose. He's one stroke behind his rival in this event. Let's take a look at Justin Rose, shall we? Okay. Oh, that is simply brilliant. What a shot. All over the parking lot, but a chip in for par saves the day. And we're ahead of him by one. Marshall has the lead in this one. Let's see what happens here at the eighth. Going with the five wood. Okay, that'll work. Would need to make a long putt to secure a birdie. Ooh. Well, okay. That may not work. Oh, gee, that line was looking good, wasn't it? 15 feet to the cup. Okay. Oh, that's a clutch par. Trailing by four strokes. Still not bad, though. We're tied with Justin Rose. We're four shots behind the lead. I love a good two-shotter. Birdies on par fours feel great. We're pretty much right where we need to be. But I'm not where I want to be. This one looks to be headed towards the fairway. Okay. And now over on the fringe. Rose. He's happy. Just came off a birdie. This is Justin Rose. Okay. Just off the fairway in the first cut. Opting for the hybrid, I think. That's fine. And he's not hit the mark on that approach. A bit short with that effort. Probably could have come back just a little bit with it. Sitting at two under par. Ooh. Very crafty, that shot. Great touch. That was still a pretty good chip. Well, Rich, this player is nine holes into this. So we are one back from Justin Rose. They've struck up with their playing partner. It's early, Luke, but this player is trailing their rival. I hope to see them put up more of a fight as this event progresses. This one might roll into the rough. That was Second perfect, too. At the tenth. Okay, that's fine. It is a par five. We're going to make it in three. Five shots off the lead. This one needs to kick left. And he's safely on the green with that shot. Oh, this will be good for the momentum. Let's make this birdie putt. They've got this putt to tie Justin Rose. That did not work. A gallant attempt. Just a four footer remaining. Okay. Yeah, you'll take that. It's not what I wanted. Justin Rose. He's one stroke in front of his rival so far today. Great stuff. Wow. So after that, okay. Effort, let's take a look at the leaderboard. Still one shot behind him. Time to tee off on the eleventh. And that'll work for me. Pretty good shot there. Lining up from around 160 yards. Five strokes behind our leader. 
Looks to have opted for the eight iron. Okay. Um. Yeah. When it's perfect, it's not really straight. That's on the green, but still a fair way away from the flag. This putt for par here. Good stuff today, especially the short game. A little bit more today. that way. We got it. That's a par. Solid par putt, that. Currently one under for the event. Let's see what happens here at the 12th. There we go. That's fast. Uh oh, this one leaking out to the right. Not a bad shot, that. Still a chance. Would need something special to happen to get the birdie here. And that's not quite there. Okay. So right about. There. I think we might have it. Nope. Just didn't drop. Well, this would be a good one to make. It's for par. We got that one though. Nice little putt to hole, that one. <sighs> Just not and quite now there. Over to Justin Rose. He's currently one stroke better than his rival and playing partner today. Oh, that had eyes for it. Lovely shot. I mean, you've got to expect this kind of stuff when you start up a rivalry with a tour player. There's and we're do. two back from Justin Rose. Teeing off here on the 13th hole. Not sure if they got that one flush. This wow. On the fairway. Penny, how's that ball lying? Guys, you know the worst lie you've ever seen? Yeah, time's up by 10. This is nasty. Good option. Take your medicine and try and get it up and down from there. Getting ready to play their third. Well, a little off the target with that okay. one. Okay. Oh, a little shorty baker on that action there. Didn't that look good for Wow. Him? Yeah, that's a touch of class. Terrific little chip. Such we soft almost touch. had it. Well, that's a shame. And we're back that by three. The standings, that's for sure. And now on the tee, coming off a bogey. We are even. Reclaim some momentum. Beautiful swing there. Okay. What kind of shot are they facing here, Henny? He's setting up here from about 115 yards. That's not Henny terrible. That one. Trying to get to one under here with this putt. He's staring down a birdie putt here. On, nope. Get in the hole. Okay. As soon as I let it go, I knew it. Okay, that is a par. Time to take a look at Justin Rose. He's currently ahead in this rivalry. Let's see what happens. So we could be doing a lot better. Um, I think we'll have a good second round. Our current leader is enjoying a two-stroke lead. And that's if we can actually make it to. This hole is a long par four. That second round, it depends on where the cut is going to be. That should find the fairway. And what are we looking at here, Henny? Setting up here from about 155. Nice. Oh, stop it. What a shot. And as good as they putt, you almost have to guarantee this one. Here's Justin Rose. 
Okay. Let's catch up with the current proceedings. Looks like a pretty straightforward five-footer to me. That should work, and it does. And with that, that's their okay, we are one under. one under. Our leader is a couple of shots up at this stage. And we've arrived at a par three. Opting for the nine iron. Okay, and I should have... Yep, that shot safely on the green. Outside chance for birdie here. Ooh, okay. That's disappointing. Can't believe he did that. That drives you bonkers as a player. There we go. Good, good par. Well, that'll maintain the momentum. Nice par putt. Now, eight shots back after that hole. And we're three shots back from Justin Rose. Here we are at the 17th tee. Oh, great swing. So we're really going to need to come back in the next round. Um... And now over to Justin Rose. Well, let's see what he's done. He's feeling good. Just birdied the last hole. Justin Rose now. Going with the six iron here. Okay. Well, what a wonderful shot into the 17th and sets up another putt inside birdie range. You know what? That deserves a golf clap. And Henny, what are you seeing down there? Setting up here from about 165 yards. We should be able to do something with that. That's right out of the copy books. Exquisite. Trying to get to two under with this part. Okay, over just a touch. Looking we got good. it. Mark it down. That's birdie number five. Okay. And with it, he'll be One more hole. Our current leader is enjoying a two-stroke lead. But it's time to tee off on the 18th hole. There we go. Good drive. Oh, well played. Good approach. And here we are with the third shot. This one's headed right, Rich. Okay. Yeah, not a bad effort. That Two way. shots for par. And a chance to hold your putt. Looking for back-to-back -back birdies here, Luke. Nope. Ooh, right by the hole. What's in front of them, Henny? Straight back up this hill. Can be firm here. Okay. And that signs off on today. And that's round. a par. Two under for the round. So after the opening round. And, a pretty solid and we are two behind and Justin Rose. The pace. Yeah, I... Okay. Here's our second round. Luke, I'm at the Champions Invitational at Echo Park Golf Club. So we're going to see... Ooh, this is already a bad start. Not really what they were hoping for there. Lining up now, this shot from the fairway bunker. Okay. 
Henny, I'm sure you've got a better look of that lie. Smell on the fairway, but it's not bad. It's a good lie in the first cut. Looks like this one's bunker bound. That one seemed to get Doesn't seem like we're oh, look at that. The wind just wreaking havoc with that shot. Disappointing. Oh. It doesn't seem like oh, maybe it's the wind. Yeah, this one is for bogey. Okay. Well, that's disappointing, Rich. Getting underway over well, I'm going to start off with the bogey. Not tragic. You got a lot so we're going to have to really watch that wind. We're down by forward. three on our rival. We have a par five. Okay. Ten mile an hour wind at our back. A uh, bit out of shape with that swing. Look at the rhythm back. Well, this is some lovely momentum to take into the tournament coming off a last start win, Rich. Can't think of any better momentum. Obviously, the players firing on all cylinders. Sit back, watch, and enjoy. Okay, there we go. Yep, that'll work. That's fine. And this shot here coming up from around 130 yards. Pop a breeze moving this golf ball left to right. Good shot there, Beamer. That's not terrible. Is from 14 feet. Little birdie look in here. Oh, so close. Not quite. Okay, so. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be another. Oh, this one's a par. Okay. Yep. Ooh, nice line. Yeah, okay. We'll hold. Let's go to our man John on the ground. There's so windy days, so we're gonna have to adjust. Hey guys, we are checking in with Ricky Fowler as he gets set for his next shot here on the 14th. And after that effort, that's how it looks. Still three shots back from our rival. Welcome to this hole. Okay, we've it's got a par four. four. And after a par at the last, a chance to perhaps signal some intent. And the wind is no coming arm, in no right at us. Shot. This shot from 120 yards. Back into the wind. They need to flight this one down. Okay, yep. Really does affect goal, it, so. Yeah, wind took that one offline in a hurry. This line doesn't look too tough, just in the first cut, up by the green. And this one is for his par. Okay. And, wow. Let's try and make this one. Only drop the one shot. And we're going to double bogey here. And this one will be for double bogey. Okay, so we've got wind and it's it's hurting us. Uh, we're down by, by five. This might be the first rival that we don't beat. This hole here is a par four. There we go. And what's in front of them there, Henny? Uh, he's about 155 from this whole location. And choosing the eight iron here. And that'll work. Here's a look at Rambo from a moment ago. This is his third. Okay, we don't care about him because he's not our rival. This would be a momentum saver here, getting this up and down. Wow, that almost went in the hole. Should not have moved it. He has this putt to save his par. It's 
Okay. There's par. We could be doing a lot better. Going with the seven. Better bring okay. the binoculars. Gonna have a hard time seeing the hole from there. Outside chance here for the birdie. About what, two and a half? Two and a half, okay. See what this will do. Wow, close. That'll sting a bit. Five feet coming up to the cup. And we got it. They're nicely hold. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard. Well, I love these holes. The short par for DB Bold or lay up. Really hoping they play this one aggressively. And ooh, no, no, no. And from the bunker here. Now just one over. Okay. coming up here this is not a very good tournament so for me so good. Well, what about that, Rich? A great I wasn't that worried Bunkered after the first the round but now green, but saves the par with that putt. Johnny Mac, what's it's gonna take a lot to win guys we are checking in with Ricky Fowler as he gets set for his next shot here on the 18th I think it might actually take a lot to beat Justin Rose too. Being all over the parking lot, chipping in for the par. Our leader is currently enjoying a four-stroke advantage. Let's see what happens here on the seventh. There we go. Looking shot this. It's heading into the rough, I think. Why? Well, doesn't take a genius to know that this is not a good place to be. Going with the 9 iron, I think. Playing their fourth shot. Okay. And this would be a great par putt if you can make this. And we should have it. We do. Nicely hold. Okay. This is not a good tournament at all. Sitting at one over for the event. Just a couple to play here on the opening nine. Here's the tee shot at the eighth. Not too sure what they were trying to do with that swing. Not the result they were after there. And another missed green in regulation. My, oh my, this has been a long day. This putt from around 18 feet. This is huge for momentum. Got to try and hold this. This for par. Try that. That's frustrating. Putting okay. Good stroke. And makes we are 
Sitting at two over. Not doing Eagles. well. Unfortunately, backing up slowly but surely on that leaderboard, Luke. And a par four awaits at this next hole. Okay, we um. Not bad. We missed that Did one. Like the view from where you're standing, Henny. A little bit of breeze ruffling the old hair, and it's coming straight on. Well, now you just got to pray for good luck, because that one's heading towards the sand. Always a tough shot to get out of. They'll have to get their best bunker technique out here because this is nasty. Okay. Well, if you can make that big putt, it'll save that bunker shot, that's for sure. This is from miles away. Yeah, that looked to be a bit of a misread. A little too cautious on that effort. Horrible. John, you're down there. What's happening? Hey guys, we are checking in down here with just. I'm Rose. completely speechless. I'm just, I just can't get anything going in this round. And look at that. Wow. Needed it. Needed that in a big way, chipping in for the par. Well, Rich, as we I thought we could have made something out of the second round. So far. Well, Luke, this rivalry we have been watching has been fun. This player is behind their rival as we make the turn. It'll be fun to see how this matchup shakes out. But the wind is just really wreaking havoc on my game. Okay. That's tidy. John, do you have any info down there? Hey guys, we are checking in down here with Justin Rose as he gets set for his next shot here on the third. How close was wow. In the hole? Great shot. And back to the point. He's shot. killing me. Sitting at three over par. Always nice to have a birdie putt. Nowhere close. This putt is about 15 feet to the hole. This for pa Okay, so with where we're at, we are about halfway Okay Let's just try to finish strong here. Our leader is up by four shots now. Time to step on your tee shot here at this long par four. I'd be booking in for some lessons if I was swinging it like that. Wow. Henny, do you have a better look at this lie? He's eyeing this up and he's pleased with what he's seeing. This is sitting nicely. There we go. We're on the green. This is an extremely long putt. We might even have to hinge on this one. Okay, we'll just take whatever that is and... Oh, what a shame. That would have been a nice one to hold. Oh, these are good for the momentum, these ones. Right on eight feet. Take my par. I don't mind the look of this. That's a good putt for par. You'll take it. Just a bad tournament all the way around. Our leader is currently enjoying a four-stroke advantage. 
We have a par three on this one. Going with the eight iron here. Better be careful out there. It's danger. It's heading left, isn't it? This would be a great up and down. Ooh, wouldn't that have wow. Been nice? That's a well played okay. shot there. Oh, Dr. Chapinski strikes again. Yep, nice to make a mid range par putt. As long as we're not What's getting worse. Hey guys, we are checking in down here with Justin Rose as he gets set for his next shot here on the fifth. It's time to check on the leaderboard. Our current leader is up by three shots. I just don't know what to say. This, this is and after a the last, to maybe take a step in the right not really what I was hoping for. Nicely done. Time for the second shot here at the 13th. Going with a three wood here. There we go. This one is headed to the right. Now, a little off the mark on that approach shot. Wynn got that one and took it wayward. Getting ready to play their third. And if this can go down, he'll save par. Okay. That's essentially a straight shot. Well, it's time to head back down to the fairways. John, what's up, mate? Hey, guys, we are checking in down here with Justin Rose as he gets set for his next shot here on the sixth. And he's... Let's take a look at the leaderboard. He's not having that tough of a time. Our leader is a couple of shots up at this stage. Let's begin the 14th. They are trailing, heading into the short par four. Do they take it on to the layup? How much do they trust their swing right now? We'll find out. Okay, that is a perfect. Wonderfully played. What kind of shot are they facing here, Henny? Our wind's just going to knock the ball down. It's straight at the back. Wow. Just a little bit harder, I would have had it. And here we are with the third shot. Big putt for Pai coming up. These are on rails. Looking okay. Up. That will work. So no change on the leaderboard for this player after that hole. We need to do better. Arrived at a par four hole. Oh, golf clap. That's a beauty. What kind of shot are they facing here, Henny? I'd say he's about 165 from this flag. Looks to have chosen the seven iron. And yeah, we just. Is that what they had wow. Greens and regulation have not been in order today. They need to improve on this. Wow. Hey, we hit the post that or the close. the pole. And he needs this to save par. And there it is. Okay. And our intrepid on course reporter. The only reason that went into the sand trap, uh, we just got a bad bounce. With Justin Rose as he gets set for his next shot here on the eighth. Oh, what a super shot. And with that, he'll move to five under par. Our current leader is enjoying a two stroke lead. Teeing off here on the 16th hole. Chosen the pitching wedge here. And tidy looking shot that one. Not bad. The perfect wind swing. Nice and easy. John, give us an update. What's shaking? 
Hey guys, we are checking in down here with Justin Rose as he gets set for his next shot here on the ninth. Okay. Okay, let's get back to the action. Just 10 feet to the cup here. Their short game has been very impressive. They've been really sharp today. Oh, that was such a good stroke. That putt went a bit I away. thought we had that. A par putt on the table. Got this one. Not a bad line. That's miss. a par. Oh, Rich, is there anything more disappointing setting up what you think is a makeable birdie putt, but unfortunately not able to convert? Sitting at three over for the event. Teeing off here on the 17th hole. There we go. And this shot from about 150 yards out. Wind moving the golf ball left to right. And I probably could have backed off a little bit more. Yeah, nicely played. They're a long way from the hole here. And instead, I have a long putt. Here for a look at a birdie. So from there, I've got about all. And the rivalry seems to be okay. Getting the hang of it. That will bring them closer together on the leaderboard. Moments like that deserve another viewing. Let's take a look at the replay. Now this, this is how you putt. Take another look at this. And that was for Birdie. Okay. Currently at two over par. Moving up the leaderboard. I like it. And this is our last hole. A par five. The final hole of this round. And the wind is... coming back at us. That should find the cut stuff. Okay. Uh, great shot. Around 110 yards to go. Breeze straight into him. Now that's heading further left than they wanted, I think. Time now for the fourth shot. Oh, that's the hands of a surgeon. Lovely touch. Love watching this player around the greens. And we got the par. And with that, that closes out the event for this player. We did not do great. Well, Rich, after coming so close to going back to back, you just wonder the way they finished. Maybe the occasion just got a little bit too much for them. Luke, this player did everything. To so we finish in 63rd. PGA Tour, unfortunately, coming up just a touch short. And ooh. still two awesome weeks. I'm Luke Elvey, alongside... Uh, we may have lost our clubs and our balls. ...folks at HB Studios. It's goodbye for now. And he beat us. Uh, we did get some money and we got uh, some iron shafts. Uh, we found your performance recently has not represented what we as a brand stand for. We're sorry to say we've decided to terminate our partnership with you. Okay, that's fine. Uh, 2K, decline. Tattoo golf, decline. Uh, Cobra, you know what, we'll accept. 
So there we have it. Uh, we're still in first for the FedEx Cup. Uh, we lost Callaway for our sponsor. Uh, we ke- we got to keep Adidas, but uh, we're using Cobra Clubs and Bridgestone Balls. Um, we're going to get rid of Justin Rose. And our next tournament will be the Falcon Open at Fox Home Golf Links. But we're going to play that one in the next episode. I want to thank everybody for watching. My name is Allstream That. Hit the like button if you like this type of content. It lets me know that you like this particular type of content and would like to see more. Hit the subscribe button and ring the bell for notifications to be notified every time I post a video. And follow me on Twitter, Twitch, and Discord. The links will be in the description below. Have a wonderful day.